Welcome to the very first day by day barrel racing competition. Let's meet our contestants. First at the gate is Shaker Boy, I mean Finn, and his rider, Sophia. Sophia. So this is our course. They're gonna go through the chute, is that what it's called? Yeah. yeah. They're gonna go through the chute, around all these things in the way that you're, around all these things in the way you're supposed to go around them. And uh, you're first, mm -hmm. and this is a timed event, right? Yeah. Let's meet contestant number two. Glitz and Glam. Glitz and Glam girl. And her Oh, rider. your horse is beautiful. And her rider, Gabby, aka Always Gabby. Go check me out on Instagram. I'm underscore always underscore Gabby. And YouTube, Always Gabby. Yes. I just plug myself. She's sporting her very first polo of the season and she's got some horseback riding pants. Tell me what you are wearing today. A uh, shirt. <laughs> And a contestant number one is wearing a horse girl shirt. And, and non-breeches. And non-breeches, because this is how we roll. Have you done any barrel racing in your past? No, but I feel like she has. The horse is unsure. Have you done any barrel racing in the past? Only a tiny bit. <laughs> Just for fun? Yeah. Have you done any barrel bait racing in your past? I turned around my mom. You turned around your mom. Yeah, oh, like, you used I, your mom as a barrel? Like, Have you done any barrel racing in the past? No. no. Wow. And All right. Five, four, three, two, one. Con contestant number one is late out of the gate. And she's running the course the wrong way. And she's going. <laughs> Contestant number one is disqualified. Back to the to the starting gate. 23 seconds of failure. Contestant number two is in the starting gate and we are getting ready. Five, four, let's hope this horse does a lot better. Three, two, one. All right, all right. <laughs> this, this contestant is drunk. Time to know where to go. Whoa! Whoa! Crap! That's so hard to bear! <laughs> I didn't even have to do it. Our horse is a barrel racer! <laughs> I didn't even ask her. She was just like, boom! Whoa! Did she go? Yeah, 22 seconds! Uh, our horse is a big... <laughs> I don't know if you guys caught that, but... That was a barrel racer. <laughs> you missed it. In 22 seconds, and then on the final one, you're supposed to gallop oh. home. And we were trotting a stout cantered home, and I'm like, oh. Listen, where are you? So basically, they did a mock barrel course, and she went around those barrels, and then when it was at over, when she was done the three barrels, she booked it home. <laughs> she knew what to do. She is a barrel horse. <laughs> wow. All right, you guys, we are going to put an instant replay of that because we got to see it. Contestant number one, the rider of this barrel horse, contestant said, number two. contestant number two of this barrel horse said she felt like the horse was taking off on her. She all of a sudden, she thought she just was going for it and she wasn't. And then the horse stopped. Yeah, yeah, then she just stopped. And the mother of contestant number two started to. Freak out a little bit inside, but yeah, it was so it obvious so that fast that, that this horse has barrel raced. We suspected it for so I, long. I, we all suspected it because of how she turns on a dime. Stella, you, and you know what? It's so crazy. I feel like she feels okay, alive. So, I, so contestant number two's mother, my mother, was like, when she started cantering, and I'm like. Yeah, I may have closed my eyes. Her, her mother may have closed her eyes, but. This horse came off of that round and was like, oh, let's do it again. Like, I feel like she knows it. I mean, she's in her element. How did you feel?
feel after that run? I got 22 seconds. Contestant number one got 23 seconds of doing nothing. All right, do you think you're gonna come out stronger in your second round? No. Are you scared of her going into your second round? No. All right, contestant number one, back in the stew, shoot. I did, I did two, I did two um, practice runs, but I know where I'm going. Okay, so contestant number one did a few practice runs so that she knows where she's going. Does your horse know where he's going? He says yes, your horse says yes. All right, set the clock. Five, four, three, two, one. Contestant number one is a little late out of the shoot. Woo, looking good. Wow. Good job. Contestant number one, two is laughing at contestant number one. That's fun. 27 seconds. We actually cantered. You actually cantered. That was really smooth. All right, just wait, just wait. Okay, you get in your I'm thing. I'm nervous, I'm so excited. <laughs> You're nervous. All right, contestant number one, how did you feel about your second round? That was way better than the first round. Do you think you're gonna win? Probably not, because she's an actual barrel racer. Finn, do you think we are gonna win? No. <laughs> okay, move out of the chute. Oh, he says yes. I gotta go. All right. All right, so this is a little nerve wracking now. It's just a small space. Okay. I know she's not gonna do it again though, because that's horse logic. They do something amazing, then they don't do it again. Right, and we caught you on camera doing something amazing. Okay. Let me back up first. Okay. She's ready. The horse is ready. She's staring ahead. Her eyes are bright. Five, four, three, two, one. Whoa, that horse can turn. Oh my. Did you try to dance on me for a second? Did you try to dance on me for a second? Oh. There it is. Good girl. 22 seconds. Good girl. You need to send a video to Fiona. Okay, so. The most amazing thing that I see is how, how like she's. Okay, I'm walking her because she was good. Yeah. Can I give her a little walk? Yeah. It was how good she can turn. Like, can she turn so good? Like, she goes around those barrels like she's done it her whole life. Because she has. <laughs> All right, final round, people. Contestant number one to the shoot, or whatever you say in barrel racing. Um, okay, contestant Anthony number one. Snyder. Contestant number one, are you feeling confident in this last and final round now that you figured it all out? Yes. Are you feeling confident? <laughs> yes. All right. Then, let me ask you some questions. Are you going to canter? So I mean, yes. that no lead changes. Are you going to halt? Did yes. Gallop. Did you do that? No. Oh, okay. I feel like she canters better when she's coming out of that than she does in real life. Like there's not as much anxiety. She just, she goes at a normal speed. Five, four, three. I should really watch more barrel racing so I know what the heck I'm talking about. Five, four, three, two, one, go. Woo, faster out of the chute. I watched our trainer's channel, Stride to Harmony, and they said that if you fail the first one, just give up. <laughs> 32 seconds! Yeah, you missed the first one and then you're done and, and finished. 
Good try though. Good try, Sophie. It takes real bravery, contestant number one, to go out there and do something you've never done on that horse before. I'm surprised she's not antsy. Contestant number three, are you nervous? Have you, are you nervous as heck? No, I'm excitedly nervous. Like, I just want to go. Like, I'm nervous, but I just want to go. Like, I'm not scared nervous. I just want to go nervous. You would only do what your horse is, is comfortable with, right? Yes, you would never she push her too far? Okay. Are you ready for your final run? She's like, yes. Are I you excited? Yeah, she was. She's born to do this. All right. Five, four, three, two, uh oh. One. You did just as good a time, 22 seconds. She's like, I'm done, I'm going in the bar now. Good girl. All right, that's it, you're all done, my love. Good job. And the winner is? Me. Contestant number two on this amazing, gorgeous tour. All right, you could probably go again, Stella can't. Stella's good. Stella's good, she's not even sweating. Like, she didn't even break a sweat, but I mean. We're gonna have one final round of practice for contestant number one. All right, you want me to time it? Three, two, one, go. Three seconds. Okay, that's as fast as my first one. Yeah, it was as good as your first one that you failed in 22 <laughs> seconds. Good job. Good job, contestant number one. Excellent job doing something new that you've never done before. Was it nerve wracking? No. Can you tell the people your secret to confidence? Why are you so confident suddenly? Um, if you have a horse that um, love you, then it's good. Then you'll have all the confidence in the world? Well, not just that. You have to have a bond with your horse. You have to have a Palomino. As long as you have a Palomino and a bond, you'll be good at anything you do? Yes, and if you trust your horse. And if you trust your horse. Do you trust your owner? Then do you trust Do me? you trust your owner? Then do you trust me? He's still deciding. <laughs> Then do you love me? Then do you love Stella? Number two, you are the winner. Congratulations on your amazing win. Do you have any words of wisdom? And can you tell the people why you are so darn competent, confident these days? Because I'm the boss of the horse. So is it because Except you- Except for when she decided to canter. Is it, is it because you, oh, so you feel confident because you know you can control your horse? Yes. And is it that you have your horses at home so you can practice and get to know them and spend time on them? Yeah. Learning? Yeah, like so, this. So if you have your horses at home, you will be confident? Yes. Thank you for watching Day by Day Farm. Um, first ever and last barrel racing competition, or at least last, last with these horses. Oh, we should have had Storm in here. All right. Second last barrel racing competition because we will be doing this again with our two geldings. Um, Leave in the comment below what other kind of riding you would like us to compete in. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you in the next Bye. one.